we've all had times when it's been really important for us to communicate a personal truth or to have other people rally on to our side or at least to have them listen to an idea that we're working on or consider helping out on a project that we'd love to have move forward. And we've all had the experience of, well, your idea is shut down. It goes no further, doesn't get talked about, bad feelings abound, and <laughs> it just doesn't progress. And what could have been something really fruitful moving forward just doesn't even start. You don't even get walking around. <laughs> you never get your project to fly. This short video is about that. And what I see is one of the important distinctions and understandings that you'll have to make when considering sharing an idea that you'd love to catch on, passing on a story with a message, or having a project catch fire with support from your friends, family, community, and its seen perspectives. I'll say that this way. When you're passing on a message, it's really important that you actually get to see that, well, there's a message you're trying to pass on, sure, but there's also the messenger, and there's also the receiver of the message. And at anywhere in this transaction, your idea can get shut down. The basic idea here, though, is to understand that these things are in play. So, when considering sharing an idea that you would love to catch fire, consider, will the message be received? Will the messenger be accepted? Or is the messenger accepted? And will the message be received? And also, consider the other side of the equation. If you're at the receiving side, putting yourself in the other person's shoes, would you accept this message? Because very often, we're so much in our heads that <laughs> we, we have a brilliant idea that we think you know should just catch fire, but we never begin to consider thus the person we're passing on something to even consider us, me, you, the messenger, to be someone to listen to, to be someone who's known, liked, trusted, to be someone who's an authority figure, or at least just someone who should be considered. You know, if people don't see you as a valid messenger, there goes your message, no matter how valuable, no one will listen to you. And it's very important to consider the message. Have you packaged it right? It may feel to you like it's the absolute truth and it should be easy to pass on, but consider, does the message fit both the messenger and the receiver? And if not, reconsider redressing it, rebuilding it, or repackaging it just enough so it can be heard. And don't tell your truth as you will. But you gotta get your foot in the door so you can get in the door. Otherwise, your idea will not fly. And then there's the other end of the equation. Put yourself in the other person's shoes. If from that point of view, you wouldn't even listen to the story, and from that point of view, the other person, they won't even consider you as someone worthy listening to, that's it. Your idea goes nowhere. So to wrap this up, consider not just your message, not just the veracity or the usefulness or the beauty of the thing that you're trying to pass on, but also consider will they listen to this messenger? And will they be an accepting receiver? And consider trying to do whatever it takes so that your message gets heard. Because after all, the meaning of a communication isn't in what the hell you say, but it's in what gets heard and understood and passed on. So I hope this helps for you to consider seeing your message in 360. The message, who sends it, and who receives it, and how to carry it going forward. It's not just what you say, it's what gets accepted and passed on. And I hope you use this going forward. And I also hope to see you at Comply, which is a workshop intensive that my friend and mentor, Ken Sumera, will be doing on the 26th of August, 2017, somewhere in Pasig. Um, check that out. That's something that <laughs> it'll really hurt to miss out on if being able to communicate your ideas 
not just clearly, but so well that they're received beautifully and passed on is an important thing to you. So, see you at Comply. Cheers.